Okay, good day. Welcome to another guitar tutorial. Today, we are going to learn about the J major chord. There are a number of ways that we can represent the J major chord. This is another G major chord or something like this. You can add this or oh, this bar chord over here. Okay, but today we're going to learn about this G major chord. So other times we learn about all, all those J chords. There are several ways of representing your J chord over here. You can even represent the J chord like this. This is your J chord. But let's First of all, learn about this. Okay. So our J chord is made up of the J, J, the B, and the D. Okay. So on the E string, you have your J. That's a J over here. E, F, F sharp, J. Okay. And let's go to our B. We know that our B is part of the G major chord. So you play it open. Next string is our G. Our G is part of the G major chord. That one is two, is played open. Then we come to our D. Our D is part of the G major chord. So that one two is played open. Then we come to our A string. So on our A string over here, this A string, we are going to locate our B on the A string. So you have your A, B flat, B, 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 A, B flat, B. So we now have your this, this finger here, and this one here. Okay, so we are going to add our last note. That's our G. And we know that the string on top here is the same as the string down here. So it means that our J will be located at this place. This place. That's our J. Where my thumb is, where my thumb, my thumb is, is, is our J. So the J major chord is made up of our J here. Our B here, our G here, our D here, our B, and our G. Okay, so that's the G major chord. Okay, so let's meet once again another time and learn about the F major chord. Okay, bye.